brand new E96 product that we use for condition monitoring. Have you seen any before? Aha! So we're going to unbox this together. So as you can see, it's an advanced camera image camera that we use for condition monitoring. All right, I unbox it. Aha, exactly. This is what we are talking about. This is the camera. This is the camera. This is the camera. This is the camera. Some advanced camera, image camera. And um, we have a lot of accessory. For instance, this is the battery. This is the battery. The battery is two. If you are using one, you can plug one, you can be charging one. So it's two. And um, we have the charging base. This is the charging base. This is the charging base. This is what to connect to uh, to your socket, your socket outlet. Then you insert this. You insert this. Aha! You insert this. There's light here that will show. Uh, there's indication here that will show that either charging or full. You have you see the two lights here one here this one is for this why the other one is for the second battery so i want to charge the second battery as well i'm going to insert it like this aha uh -huh, like this yes so when we have full when the battery is fully charged this will display and this will also display but when the battery is still charging this will be blinking it will be blinking as well meaning the battery is receiving power so um and after that you can remove like this you can remove and keep you can also remove the second one and keep uh -huh. so that is the battery as for battery then what do we have here we have uh, let's see some we have some papers here this first one is a thank you from the general manager for the product why this one is just uh how to connect the uh, the adapter this adapter the importance of this adapter and how you can use the adapter that's what the instruction is all about then uh, this one is a calibration calibration certification that shows you the uh, the calibration dates and the model of the product and of course this is the software if you want to install the software that you can use for this device this is the software step by step on what you need to do on how you can get the software installed on your laptop or on your either your laptop or your desktop or the case may be um we still have uh, other accessories we still have other accessories um what do we have here what do we have here? Hey. What do we have here? All right, we have a. Uh, let's see what we have here. Aha! Uh -huh. See what we have here. These are other accessories that you can use to hang. This is the bag. This is the hanger that you can use to hang the your that you can use to hold your your. Uh, thermal image camera then this is the lens cover this lens cover it has a, a its own accessory that you can use to lock it or that you can use to install it and we won't have the allen key here i'm still going to show you how you can use where, where you can use the allen key so um as regard this uh, screw this is what they are expecting you to do since this is the lens, lens cover you cover it like this uh, yeah you cover it like this why you use this boot or not uh, you this boot is it boot or not yeah, i don't know so you use this aha uh -huh, to screw it to hold it so it's going to be firm it's going to be firm so after that you can decide to open your lens cover like this 
can decide to cover cover it like this just because of dust not because of dust so that is how that's what i want to work for all right uh let's let's check what we have what we have for the um other accessory ah this is very nice oh boy. very nice aha this is another accessory we have memory card let me quickly insert the memory card can uh -huh. i've opened it it's even 16 gig oh. it's 16 gig not 8 gig it's 16 gig so you open here and um, you insert it this is the memory card and a 16 gig a 16 gig aha so we're going to insert it we're going to insert it That's right. yes i've inserted it then i cover this i cover this place i cover this place so i've inserted my memory card successfully let's check what we have again we have this uh, cleaner you can use this cleaner to clean the face to clean the face or clean the lens as the case may be so that's what i want to work for then let's unbox further we have a lot of accessory here we have a lot of accessories um, uh -huh. Uh -huh. we have um, yeah we have usb cable this is type c type c charger these are type type c charger that you can use to either charge the thermal image camera directly without using the base so you can actually plug the thermal image camera directly directly to uh to the power without using the base so and also at the same time you can also use the cable you can also use the cable to connect the uh the device to your desktop so that you can upload whatever uh, video, uh, whatever images you want to upload or probably you want to generate a report and uh, on that connection sometimes if you want to connect your your um, your desktop maybe your desktop is using HDMI cable you can also connect your HDMI cable here it's an adapter you can connect your HDMI cable here once you connect your HDMI cable here then you can now connect your type c charger type c uh, type c mount to your device to your device and where do you connect it to you connect it right here you connect it right here i don't know if you can see it aha uh -huh. that is the that's where to connect it so meaning with the hdmi cable you can connect this device with your desktop and with type c charger you can also connect this device to your uh, to your desktop all right we move forward the lens cover also have extra cover meaning if you don't want to use uh the other one that i that i showed you the right time which is this this is the first lens cover why this is the second lens cover as the case may be so you can use it so um that is all about uh, about that now let's check uh, do we still have other items the answer is yes we have chargers we have the plug different kind of plug depending on the countries you you are buying the item from and we also have the the uh the plug here or the plug or the 30 amps plug aha uh -huh. this is uh, these are the plugs these are the plugs these are the plugs let me take away this so that we can see what we are talking about see what we are talking about uh -huh. so as you can see we have a multi we have a several uh, plug that we can use to connect the device to uh, electricity depending on the country so you are so as for as for us in nigeria we prefer this this is what uh, this is what uh, we use in nigeria we also use this 
but you need uh, multiple sockets to um, to power this so that um, the you will not uh, damage the the terminals so meaning wherever you are you have choice you have choice that is the advantage of this advanced thermal image camera um what do we have again this is the charger this is the charger this is the charger so now look at this look at what we are talking about this is the charger why this is the socket this is the uh the plug now you can insert this assuming you want to charge just insert it just insert it like this. So once you once you hear that noise, so once you hear that noise, meaning it has already entered. And if you want to remove it, there is a um, a push button here. Just push the button and then remove it. Exactly. And if you want to use another one, this another one, another plug entirely. So you just insert it like the way I inserted the other one. Just press it until it make it make noise. Once you hear the click, uh -huh, meaning it has already connected. So with this you can plug. And if I want to remove it again, I'm going to press this button down and pull it out easily. And pull it out easily. Uh -huh. So that's one of the that's why they call it advanced thermal image camera. Do we still have any other thing here? Yes. You only have this hanger that you can use to hang, that you can use to uh, carry your uh, your device, the thermal image camera. So it has a lot of accessories. So with this, I with this, I believe you're going to enjoy the device. Let us power the device. How do we power the device? So we're going to insert the battery like we said the other time. We're going to insert the battery so we insert the battery like this like this i don't know if you can see it aha there is interlock inside it that will not allow you to that will not allow the battery to penetrate and if you turn it like this there is another interlock that will that will, that will prevent you from inserting it meaning you are inserting it wrongly so meaning uh once you turn your hand like this and the battery is going inside meaning you are very very correct with what you do so you can just insert it and it's going to make a sound showing that it has connected exactly so now we can go ahead and power our device we can go ahead and power our device this is the power button I don't know if you can see it this is the power button the power button has already on the device the device is still on the device is still on you can decide to be clicking it with your bare hand and the device will be responding oh my so God. like as, as you play with your android phone you can also play with uh, with this so that's on already so if you want to know how to how to use it effectively on the field in the plant in the factory aha to monitor your devices to monitor your electric motor to monitor your transformer to monitor uh, your your power lines oh and etc drop your comment at the comment section let me know if you have interest in that i'm still going to make a video that will show you how you can actually uh, how you can use it effectively and then we're going to look at the function what are the things what are the internal functions what are the things we need we, what, can, what are the things you can actually do with the thermal image camera if you have if you have interest in that drop your comment at the at the comment section so that i do another video in which i'm going to use the thermal image camera physically and you are going to upload the result of the uh, of the thermal image camera i'm still going to even connect it to laptop if you have interest in that drop your comment at the comment section i'm still going to make a video on that but 
on your based on request so now after that after you've used it and now you want to shut it down go back again and press the button again the same power button press it then it's off already as you can see it's off already so i can now go ahead and remove my battery can i go ahead and remove my battery the same way you inserted it hold it and drag it a little uh -huh. going to open so the same way you inserted it you remove it over okay. here and you remove it can you subscribe press subscription button and also like the video thank you very much for your time a talented electrical instructor A good teacher has come again Billy Bernard